Hello fellow gamers and welcome back to Box of Gaming and of course Factorio. So, where were we? It's been a few days, I know. It's been a few days, but um, I've had some other stuff to play and uh, I did promise myself when I came back that uh, I would uh, play only things that I would really enjoy and never again um, just for YouTube. So, you know, take it or leave it. Probably some people will not like it. Um, personally, I think that's the only way to go right now, because otherwise I'll just lose interest. And, um, I think what we'll have to do is set up some more mining here. Um. Uh, well, that's a good thing. I thought maybe. Well, we're, we're missing this little bit, though. Oh, the, the mess. The mess is real. <laughs> oh, this is not... This is not how you do these things, uh, people. <laughs> uh, well, I mean... <laughs> it doesn't even cover everything. Uh, okay. Well, I mean... I guess this this works, right? Uh, yeah, I mean, it it looks a bit shabby, and uh, you know, it's probably not the most efficient use of a belt, but at the same time, I feel like um, it's beautiful. It's it's beautiful in a post-apocalyptic way, you know. Uh, I guess. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to fix that at some point. Look at that! It's completely backed up already. Um. <laughs> uh, okay, stop. Stop. <laughs> this is. Oh dear. Alright, that's better. We'll make it two belts because that's probably a bit more... Yeah, and I think this will do... I mean, I slow down right now, but I think that's gonna stop once I put a... Uh, a splitter or two here. Um, might as well do the fast one. Okay, and then we just put down... Our belts all the way up, and I guess we go straight. No, let's go here. Oh, come on, tree. Um, yeah, I guess we just go. Did I just shoot my own belt? Because that, that repair belt's going. Um, Alright. So that should easily be able to handle these miners even more, but... Yeah, better to have overkill in the belt, I guess. We could make faster belts, but... Eh. It's fine. Okay. Um. Okay, well, we ran out of belts. That's... See, I would really like it if I got some belts delivered to me. Like, 200 always. But I guess there's nothing... Uh, it's not in a chest yet, I guess. No. Hmm. I am a bit tired of this uh, world, though. I think we might have to change this world into something a bit more. Uh, I don't know, something a bit more new. Alright, there we go. So now. Logistic robots. Actually, it might not be in range. It is not. Oh. Okay, well, whatever. We'll just get 300 built. Yeah, I, I do think it's about time time to start a new world. Um, it's been a while since we've been on this, and it's been a lot of fun. I will give you that, but uh, I think it's difficult to make something that was not optimized from the start. And optimize it. I think that's going to be a very difficult task and almost impossible, really. So, 
Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just deciding whether I want to go a bit further right now. And, uh, you know, just to, um, no, just to get a little bit more experience, I guess. Or if I just want to stop now and then um, come back strong in a new world, because I did, I do have another world, a personal world, and, it, and it's a lot of fun. Um, it's a lot more efficient than this one is, that's for sure. And I probably get only half the resources, but somehow it's actually doing better, um, which is kind of interesting. But um, yeah. It's difficult because I, I I think we'll probably start a new world soon because that will sort of get my interest back up again. It's always fun to do things new ways and in different ways and especially more efficient ways. That's it's a really a big thing, you know. Um, in this game, it's all about min maxing and, and doing things a little bit better than the last time you did it. And I feel that that sort of goes away once you have your factory for quite a while. Um, you sort of sort of settle with what you have. And uh, it feels also really dirty to fix it, if you even can. Um, okay, so I'm going to have to... I don't know really what the solution for this would be. But I guess if we mix it in here, like that, then that should work. Although it might just be too much. But surely, if it's two solid lines of iron ore with no gaps, like just two solid lines, then then this should fill up. It, there's no way that it doesn't, I think. But um, whilst we're at it, let's just change this so that this belt uh, goes into there. And then this belt goes into there. Oh, hang on. Let's, whoops. There. And so now, whoops. Uh, <laughs> why does that go like this? Okay, power pull, power pull, power pull. Up, down, up. <laughs> this is. Oh god, this is such a mess. Yeah, that's what I mean by not optimized. But yeah, this is now two solid lines of iron ore. So I really do believe that it should start uh, piling up. And it, it definitely does on this side. Not here yet, though. We might have to... Uh, although when this stacks up to full, it'll start here as well. So I think uh, I'm pretty happy with this. There's no way we need more iron ore. Then two packed lines, like absolutely 100% packed lines. Uh, oh, stuff's getting destroyed. Okay. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Lasers are not supposed to be destroyed. Are you putting back new lasers? I think you are. Oh wow, that's quite a. Yeah. Yeah, there is a bit of an issue here, actually, because there's only three lasers. Yeah, there you go. Hmm. Okay, so the coal is still going fairly well. We have plenty of copper. Now, remind me why I didn't tap this field and instead I started tapping that field. <laughs> that seems a bit of a, a bit of a stretch, but okay. And our iron lines are now f completely stuffed, completely full. So I should have iron, an iron overflow now. I do. Okay, good. Which means that a lot of circuits being made. Uh, which means that uh, we should have some blue signs going. We do. It's not a massive amount, but it's decent. Yeah, 49. Uh, do we have some accumulators as well? Oh, hold the cup, we do. 
See, I think we should probably limit this a bit more because this is not enough. Are you part of a logistic network? You are. Okay. So if I tell you to build... Really? Uh, if I told you to build this, you would do it? Yes, you would. Okay. Oh, come on. I do like the way that looks. Although I can't get in here. That's a bit annoying. Oh, crap. I'm stuck. Um... <laughs> Sorry. Wow. That's pretty sweet. We should be getting quite a bit of power from that, actually. Although, really, you need a lot more than that, in general. Yeah, so 64 of them only makes one megawatt. But, I will say that this was incredibly easy to make. So, if you had... Uh, you know, I could easily have 25 times more of that. And... Uh, that would really help with our production. Of course, now it's down because it's night. But uh, yeah, I guess we can put down more of them. I don't know how many. Uh, we can't actually go there. Let's. Uh, we don't have a robot board, so. I wish you could shoot when you had this. Uh, we had a blueprint selected. It makes sense as well, because... Oh, come on. I don't know how much I actually have, but... Uh, it looks kind of cool. Yeah, I don't even have enough solar panels for that, say. So. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. That looks beautiful, doesn't it? It's pretty, pretty awesome. What do you need? I think you just need circuits, don't you? Yeah, circuits is the issue. Oh no, steel is a problem. What? Really? Why? It's being used to make lasers. Well, that's actually quite surprising to me that steel would be an issue. Hmm. Interesting. Actually, why is it iron ore and a copper belt? Hello? This is happening a lot now. Hang on. Something is wrong. It's being smelted here? What? What? How's that? Oh, no way. This puts it on this belt? Oh, no way. Weird. I did not know that would happen. Yeah, whatever. I'm too lazy to fix it. <laughs> I did not know that that would happen. That's very interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay, well, look, guys. Um, I think this will be the last episode of our Factorio playthrough. Um, I will start the new series probably in about, uh, I don't know, probably a few days or a week or so. And uh, I'm actually very excited for the new playthrough. You'll see some new ideas, but mostly, mo mo mostly, <laughs> you'll see the same ID, but way better executed so like one of the big things that i really missed this time was we didn't automate anything except for like belts inserters and these assembling machines no splitters no underground belts no fast belts no nothing that's kind of been a thorn in my side the entire time and eventually we put up some um, pipes here because we had to and uh, it's been a big problem so that's one of the things that I definitely want to prove. And the other thing is I'd like to, as soon as we get robots, stop doing anything without robots. So pretty much everything except for like stuff that is really needed, like copper wires, for example. Um, everything else will be done with uh, robots. So this, for example, these two belts would not exist in that playthrough. Because this would done, be done by robots. So I think that'll be exciting. So thank you very much for watching to the end of this uh, of this series, and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Um, definitely one of my favorite games out there still, so um, you will definitely see more of it probably in a week or two. No, no, no less than two weeks, maybe a week. And uh, yeah, I'll see you then. Bye.